Sam Lowe here for irishboxing.com. Delighted to be joined by Paddy McCrory, the hammer. After a victory at the Fela, Paddy, that was a grueling fight tonight. Um, you said to me off camera that you feel a little bit deflated. Just talk us through it if you don't mind. Yeah, listen, I done some stuff and maybe didn't fight the way that I wanted to fight. I know I'm much, I'm much better fighter than that, I am. But I got the win, I'm, I'm still unbeaten. It was, it was a special night for me to, to top the bill at, at the false park. Um, yeah. So taking all the positives away um, and having the gra. <laughs> uh, all in all, it was a great night. Yeah, well deserved beer for sure. Um, before we get away from the fight, yeah, I just want to delve into it a little bit more. Like, it did seem like maybe one of your hands was hurt a little bit. It seemed like you were struggling to throw it. No excuses. No, no excuses. Now. I'm the one that decides to get in the ring. Um, I I know the risks of getting in the ring, and and, and um, there's no excuses for me. Yeah, fair, fair. Um, but talk me through the fight. Like, what was the kind of general plan, and what were you trying to execute in there? Like, we heard the call a lot for the jab. It seemed to be kind of yeah, not something. Maybe you were getting off too much. No, um, I, I was trying to touch with it. Trying to touch. Um, it's just when I was touching the jab, I. I I knew what was next. Probably I couldn't execute it to the way I wanted to. Mm. Um, so it was it was difficult. And then when I got inside, he was quick. So I, I, I just needed to be cagey and cautious. I probably tried a bit too hard to to land a big shot, which is which is something I've been trying to not do. And tactics or the, the game plan kind of went out the window when I started to do that because once you start that rhythm, it's it, it's hard to change sometimes. Yeah, absolutely. Was what all better than you expected in there tonight? Listen, I, I said it all week. I think people were not giving him enough respect because he's a good fighter. He he won plenty of like Titans, English Titans. He, he, he boxed in the World Championships. He, he was a good fighter. Um, I just know that I'm a much better fighter than that. Yeah. Um, let's talk about that ring walk, that entrance. It was absolutely incredible, man. Really, really incredible. What did that? Like, what, what were you feeling when you were walking out? Yeah, if I'm going to take any away from like tonight, it's that, it's that. Um, looking about and just, I, I know every person in there. Like, there was over three thousand people there tonight, and like I know them all. It's, it's insane. It's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's very special. Like, looking about and maybe me, I, I try to like, give them all time, and sometimes it, you just gotta. Yeah, like focus on the fight, but it, it was a very, it was a very, it was, it was a very special look. Like Ramon, um, Ramon, well, he, he smashed it, and then the old Seven Nations Army. It was just, it was, it was great. Class, yeah, it was incredible. The musician Ryan, right? Mm -hmm. So amazing. I was there. I was coming in behind. It was, it was amazing. And then Seven Nation Army, yeah, it was really, really good. Um, you'll never forget that one, man. No. Um, was the, is the weight a slight issue? I know because you obviously had your few fights at 175, and you looked really, really fresh there. Coming back down, has it been a little bit of a struggle? Have you felt a little different in the uh, ring? No, no, it isn't. Um, I probably made the weight a bit better for me, um, but I'm sitting a bit. As I say, I had two spars on camp, so. Um, I travelled, they got the one for one, I travelled the one for one, um, and they competed at this level, I needed them more. Yeah, and only two spars. Only two spars, isn't, but again, no excuses, that, that's, it's, I have to try and make it work, and, that, and, and that's it, but I know next time that I'll be better. Yeah, absolutely. When do you hope to be out next? Obviously, you want to probably rest up a little bit, yep. maybe a few niggles you need to recover. My friend gets married next Friday in Spain, so me and my wife is getting a few days away from the kids, which is going to be great. And then we are on a family holiday, the, the Tuesday after, so I'm looking forward, I'm off for three weeks. I'm going to rest up, I'm going to recover, and then we're going to see what's next. Jamie said there's something big for me coming up. I know Mick returns in December, there's a big show in Dublin, the end of November. Um, there's, I think there's going to be loads of options. Maybe after tonight, the ones that maybe didn't want to fight me, make one fight me now. Mm. So, listen, I'm better than I am, or than you've seen tonight, but if it gives someone confidence, now to go to say, oh, I think I want to fight him, then, then that's good.
Perfect. Look, I'm going to leave it there, Paddy. I don't want to take up too much of your time. Thank Thanks you so much for talking to Irishboxing.com. Cheers. We always appreciate it. Gentlemen. Thank well you, Belfast. Thank you, Arnold. Cheers. Well done, man.